This is a vintage wine and apple cider press. You can actually make un vino increíble para tu casa con esto. ¿Qué? <laughs> I purchased the vintage wine press at an estate sale. I need to make room in the house. My wife told me it's, it's, it's that or me, so it's going. So what can you tell me about it, man? It's made in Chicago. I couldn't find too much on it, but it's a really cool piece. You probably can't find much on it because one of the secrets to wine is you want to just kind of do it the way they did it a thousand years ago. I'm sure the Romans or the Greeks had something very similar to it. You can imagine something like this. It was a lot more sanitary, a lot more uh, efficient than actually stomping on them with right. your feet. See, so you throw your grapes or your fruit in there. This turned. Yeah. Smash the grapes. And it goes down and down and down until basically everything's crushed down to the bottom, and that's it. So how old is this? From the people that I bought it, they said they had it for over 50 years themselves. Uh, beyond that, I really couldn't tell you. Whether this wine press is brand new or really old, it's still in decent condition, and it makes wine. So really, any collector would want this thing. Any idea what you're looking to get out of it? Well, I was looking to get uh, about uh, $5.95. $5.95, OK. Yeah. Um, any particular reason you want that number? Or? It just sounds good, you know? I, I you like know what that. What sounds good to me? $3.50. Uh, how about uh, $500? All right, man, you got a deal, okay. 500. Thank you. Show them a red show. All right, okay. let's go down Thanks. here. You sure you don't want 495? Not quite, no. <laughs> the $500, I thought it was fair. I'm happy, and he has his wine press, and I have $500.